What's up guys, it's me, obviously, and today I thought I'd do something a little bit for, for video today, so I've always wanted to do this video, which I'm really excited about it, but today I thought I'd go thrifting today because, I don't know why, but over the last few, like, months, I've been really into, like, going to charity shops and thrifting and, like, going, like, random bits, so I thought, you know what, I am going to do something today, which has been a trend now for, like, five or six years, but I'm going to go to a charity shop and get some charity shop clothes, or get like a week's worth, and wear them for a week, see how I like charity shop clothes, and see what would look good on me, so. I've seen like designer clothes, going to like charity shops, and great clothes, so they are some quite good clothes, so. I thought today I'd go to every single charity shop that I can, and look for like items I can wear, wow, voice crack, and just see what looks good on me, and just like wear the outfits for a week, and maybe go out in a few of the outfits as well, so. Um, so yeah, hope if you're excited for the video, don't forget to like this video, scratch out, do all the things you normally do on a video. And so, yeah, without further ado, let's get going to some shag shops and hopefully getting a few bargains. Oh my god, it's a new dawn, it's a new day. It is another day, and I I'm about to head out to the shag shops and get some stuff for this next coming week where we're wording shag shop clothes for a week. So, I'm about to head off now. So, we're gonna try and go for in, like three shag shops, see what they are. But I know there's a shag shop which sells like things like just one pound so I might try and aim to get most stuff from there and maybe like pop around some charity bot bots shops and to go a few bits as well so that's what I'm aiming to do so I'm gonna head off now see what there is and um yeah I'm excited Okay, so I'm in like the shopping centre now where like most of the charity shops are, so I'm trying to look for like tops and shorts and whatever else you can find really, so I'm actually going to the charity shop and buy like one of the tops up to now, but I need to like try and find other bits like clothes well, because it needs like last a week, so I'll get several like tops and several like, I don't know, shorts and pants and whatever. Right, I've managed to get into one of the charity shops, so there's like men's blazers and stuff here. There's a lot of blazers, so kind of like here. So, I need to like try and find some like, I don't know, like some jackets or cardigans. So, there's like blazers here, the like, old coats and whatever. Oh, just like a jacket which I've got actually. I got mine for like Primark, but this is like, I don't know, it's not. Mine's completely different, but it's not the same colour on the checkered thing. And like suits and jackets around here. Okay, I've also managed to find a t shirt which is like Christmassy, but I thought about anyway, so it's like the Grinch t shirt and it says Christmas is cancelled. Alright, okay, now I remember the shower shop to look for. I'm actually like jeans and like shorts. I'm not sure if you can see, but I've got some jeans in there. I'm actually found some like funny red shorts as well, which I thought would look, I wouldn't say nice, but fit in with the whole charity thing, so I'm trying to adjust the vibe well, so I'll talk to you guys. And I'm really loving the charity shop right now, so I'm trying to look for some more. Well, I got most of the clothes from that charity shop, so I'm really pleased with that, but now I'm just need a few other little fits, and that should be half me done, but... Okay, I am back and I've got several bags worth of charity shop shopping, so um, here they are. So yes, this is an Aldi bag, I literally brought an Aldi bag for me to charity shop. So I didn't buy stuff from Aldi, but I thought, you know what, save the turtles and save the planet, it's how to like, bring my own bag, so and that's why it's an Aldi bag. Anyway, I've also got this Mickey Mouse bag, is it? Oh, Minnie Mouse, actually. But I got this from the charity shop as well. Um, they gave me because I asked for a bag, but I might actually use it as part of like the challenge, because it does look kind of nice, so I could use that during the next week or so. Ah, I'm gonna go through the shopping now and then try and work out how I'm gonna like do it. So today's the first day and so I'll need to make sure that the outfits last all the way till next Thursday to do the, the, the full week. So first up I got these huge jeans so they didn't have any sizing on them like they didn't have any sort of sizes so I'm kind of like scared in case like too big for me but I don't know that's what belts are there for but now I've already got like jeans but these are like really sort of baggy jeans and they're just like normal-ish jeans. It'd be funny if like 
too big for me and that's like literally one of the baggiest jeans ever but I'm quite funny. And then the next thing which I bought is these red shorts so I thought you know what if these jeans aren't good enough for me like, so I can always wear these jeans like when I go out somewhere like a restaurant or something but these shorts I can kind of like wear during the day so I like red shorts Um, it doesn't look too bad actually to be honest it's something I probably actually wear like match with like the right t-shirt or whatever I like, probably like, wear this like in general like not just for a video but maybe like in general but yeah these are these shorts which I got and then I've also got a lot of t-shirts as well so first I've got the t-shirts which I've shown you guys in the shop but this is a Christmas t-shirt and it says here Christmas is cancelled and it's like the Grinch t-shirt kind of thing and I thought it would be funny to just like wear it as part of like the week so maybe wear it with like shorts because the red text and the Grinch from actually short, so it actually looks very Christmassy as well. So that's that. I've also got these like collar t-shirts as well. So first we got this Captain Barnacles collar t-shirt. I'm not sure what that brand is, whether it's even a brand or not, but I got it anyway, and I got this like t-shirt, it's a collar t-shirt. It looks a bit rumpled and just like very old and aging, but it'd be good to probably wear. Next up, I got this t-shirt. So, uh, this is like a sports t-shirt. So somewhere I can wear like, no, it's not actually a t-shirt actually, it's a long sleeve. You can wear this like to the gym or something, even though I don't go to a gym, I've not been to a gym in like two years. Here's what an outfit would look like if you went to the gym or even like to wear during the day because it's like a thin material, it's like a sporty kind of material. So, probably wear this for like going jogging or, you know, whatever you want to do, but it looks all right-ish. Not really something I were but it's good to try new things sometimes and then I've also got this t-shirt as well so now this is a woman's like jumper but I thought it might I might get away with it but here's what it looks like so this is the first shop which I went into where I saw this and I thought I want to get it it's got like charity shop smell you know when like buy stuff from a charity shop it has like charity shop fabric smell really smells like that Anyway, what is it is it a jumper slash t-shirt or cardigan I don't know but I looked at it and I thought I'll get it. So I can wear this like during the evening or you know wherever I go out to restaurants or anywhere fancy-ish I can wear this. And then I've also got this collar t-shirt as well so yes got a load of t-shirts but I'm wearing for like seven days. We need to wear a different top each day whereas I can go like wearing trousers for like several days because I don't sweat much in trousers but in t-shirts I sweat quite often so. Here's an Adidas collar t-shirt. Now I used to have one of these collar t-shirts but like a black version. I've had it for years but I recently just like gave it to a charity shop so but thankfully it's a black version or else I would have like bought my own t-shirt back but yeah it's a blue version of the Adidas collar t-shirt. It's really baggy as well. I made sure to get like a size bigger than I like, normally get t-shirts because I can pair it with these jeans and maybe I might be able to say it like a punk rocker aesthetic. And now I have accessories. I didn't buy much accessories but I thought, I thought I'd buy a few accessories just to like I don't know try accessories because I'm not really an accessory kind of person. Like I don't really wear watches, I don't wear necklaces, I don't wear bracelets, I don't really wear anything really because I don't like the feel of them. Like I like to be completely jewellery less as you can see. But anyway but I managed to get a necklace anyway so I've got this like, beautiful yellow necklace. But I can wear this like I don't know during the evening or wherever I go out somewhere posh or Whatever, really. I won't say posh, but I mean posh ish, if you know what I mean. I've also got myself a belt as well, in case the jeans are too big. It looks like a really big belt as well, so I'm conscious that when I wear it, it's like belt will be too big and I'll have like the belt thing just like hanging out. But yeah, this is a like belt. I'm not sure if there's like a huge belt here, and you can take this like part off a small part. Um, so yeah, that's about it for my charity shop haul. So I need to wear all these during the week, and hopefully they look good. So today's a Thursday and so I'm gonna get changed from this t-shirt into the first outfit and um, wear these stuff for the full week so I'm pretty excited, probably not excited, I don't know, I don't know how to feel about that. Alright, okay, it is day one and today's quite a quiet day in the house so nothing much really going to on but I might go out for a walk so I might be wearing this thing but oh my god okay so this is the first outfit which I've worn for this week so I look like a postman. I was trying to think, find out, figure out who I looked like. Well, I look like a postman. So I got this t-shirt. I'll show you guys more detail I soon, but I was like red t-shirt, like a collar t-shirt, which is very big. It's very creased as like a raisin and um, it's like really big. But anyway, I've also got these like pants as well. These like joggy bottoms. So like really big for me as well, but um, they're all kind of matching. That's why I wanted to thought, you know what? I may as well wear something that matches. First of all, these like joggy bottoms keep like falling off. So now like, try and do something to not make it fall off but here's what it looks like so very sort of like postman-y 
and a short as well. But I'm not very good. Like, this is not something I usually wear. And, like, this, like, cold t-shirt, I have to say. I thought the material would be, like, horrible because it's, like, really old. But the material's actually quite comfy-ish, despite being a cotton cold t-shirt. Then these pants are also, like, comfy as well, despite being too big. So they don't really fall off. Oh, and also, the one thing about these, like, clothes as well, like, they don't smell very good. Like, I'm not saying they smell bad, but they literally smell, like, you know, like, rustic, like, smells, like, old box like old carpet mixed with like old box mixed with like old paper that's been wet also with a bit of wet dog as well that's what this t-shirt smells like and so does like most of the clothes in there as well so um yeah they don't smell very good but at least um i don't know all right so it's when sure the effectiveness of these like chair shop clothes i'm gonna conduct a few tests to see how they are so these are meant to be like pants for like the gym so this like called t-shirts and these like pants meant to be for the gym so you're meant to be running and i don't know squats with them or whatever so i'm gonna try to Squatting first. I'm gonna see if I can squat about three times in a row. They are quite big though, like they are this big. So I'm hoping that I'll probably not end up doing, probably not like fall down or something. Anyway, let's go. Well, not too bad. Oh, they fell. Alright, so that you can definitely do squats in these, like bend them. You know, you can just like do all. These kind of things, you can like do all kinds. So, one, two, three. Ah! I can't kick like behind, like, I, I can't do like high kicks. Like, and not because like these trousers, because I can't naturally do high kicks. Like, my bones aren't built to do high kicks. I've perhaps been trained to do high kicks before, but you can kick into them. Like, if I was to do this, then you can do it and on the spot. The high kick on the spot, the squat. Okay, these are definitely clothes you can do squats and stuff with, so these get my seal of approval for being able to do sports and activities in them, but would I really go out to a fancy restaurant with them? Probably not, but now these are also aesthetically pleasing. I'd probably say yes because they're rare and they match, so I can Love it. Okay, so I've established that you can do all kinds of outfits. You can do squats, you can do gymnastics, you can go outside, you can do all kinds. You can even get on some editing as well. Um, just like some general office work. And so yeah, I'm actually really happy with this outfit. It's a really good outfit. It matches, even though it does smell quite a bit, but you know, nothing too major. Now, this is only the first outfit, so I'm not sure whether there'll be better outfits, but I have to I'll give this outfit a... 8 out of 10 because I just don't know matches and to me matching outfits are very aesthetically pleasing and so yeah so I'm gonna go on to the new outfit now and see what tomorrow's outfit brings me so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning it is another day it's a new dawn it's a new day and I am trying to use another outfit to do today with so. so we have this outfit here it's got this like leather belt thing which like folded and crumpled in a bag we've got this like blue cloth adidas t-shirt and got say like, huge jeans as well so I'm gonna wear these right now see what they look like. Alright so I'm putting these like jeans on right now as you can see. I've got this like blue t-shirt on which doesn't feel too bad. Oh my god yeah I already like really baggy. Um, and you kind of like don't fit me. Well, they do fit me, but they're too big for me, so they're not though because I've got this belt to put on, so I'll let you sound and camel. Alright, so this is what my final result is from this outfit, which I need to wear today. So, first of all, this belt does not fit me, um, so that's the right start. We used to see jeans like really baggy. Like every time I try and walk somewhere, it makes it really so like loud, squelching noise, so, like really baggy. This blue t-shirt is kind of all right -ish. Yeah, I'm gonna just try and embrace this look. I'm worst thing about it as well, I need to go to the store as well, so I'm gonna try and dare myself to go to the store looking like this. Alright, okay, I'm in the store right now, as you can see. I'm pretty to go, I'm gonna cut this camera tape very dirty, come on. Hello. Hey, anyway, we're in the store right now and I've got the like, jacket on. Oh no, I'm gonna undo it. I completely unzip it. I had to work because it was raining outside, um, but I'm gonna unzip it and reveal the hatch. Ta da! Okay, I've done it. Outfit is revealed. I'm literally walking around the house right now. I'm trying to place on my jacket, but I'm just completely completely out. But I don't know, I'm feeling quite confident now. Like, I'm feeling like if I can, like, 
go to the store with this outfit, which does not look very good, um, if I'm honest. Like, my pants are a mess, everything's a mess. Um, I'm sure I can, like, go to a store wearing anything. Like, if I can wear a Superman suit and go to a store. Okay, I'm going to set myself a challenge, like, buy one thing from here and, like, go to checkout looking like this. See how it works out. We're now one of the busiest aisles right now, so. Yeah. Okay, I'm actually myself a pack of bamboo toothbrushes, so I want to take you to the till now and go to the till outfit. Okay, I'm back now from that store. It's raining outside, hence the wet hair. But anyway, I bought like bamboo toothbrushes, and yeah, they look really like me in the till because this happened, okay? I kind of got what I wanted, like, once and once I like, react to this, like, outfit because it's a weird outfit. And I kind of got what I wanted because I, okay, so there's like three tills in this, like, shop, well, actually six tills. And there's like one till that was open, like, trolley sort of shopping, and I uh, only had this, like, Toothbrush. So when they announced that another till be open on the tannoy thing, I immediately rushed to the same like, till. But then this person, without me realizing, was like already walking towards her, and I like I was like darting towards her because I naturally walk really fast. And then this person, because I managed to get to till first, he was like, "Oi, I was meant to get to till first. And I was like, "Okay." And literally, like I don't know why, I don't know. He literally only had this like bottle of water, and I only had the toothbrush. So it wouldn't have really made a difference. Is in like till speed, but this person wants to literally hate me because I went in front of him first with a toothbrush, even though I naturally got there first, like it wasn't like as if I was pushing in. Anyway, so this person was pretty mad at me. Um, I ended up letting him go first with his bottle of water because um, he was in a massive sulk over the fact that he couldn't be first with his bottle of water. So I practically got into a fight with a stranger while wearing this outfit. Okay, welcome to day four. I'm just about to realize where this outfit yet. So I've got this like gym outfit which is kind of like grey-tish. Got this like jacket top thing, it's like a long sleeve like jacket. I've also got this like, red pants as well because we went for the buying like clothes and chair stuff. We got to get like gym pants so I had to like you reuse like the same like pants from when I wore the red outfit on Monday and then put it with this like black gym top which to be fair now I come to think of it kind of matches because you have the black logo and you have these like red striped pants as well and then you have these like stripy white underlined thing as well so it kind of like matches even though I didn't intend for it to match so kind of like in the way I've made the best of a bad situation because I once wore like, gym pants but I couldn't so I had to wear red pants but it might have ended up like being a great combination so I'm actually really proud of myself for matching things together and making the best of the, out of the bad situation but I still wouldn't wear it though because it's like really uncomfortable like the material's just like horrible. I couldn't wear it to the gym and I'd be sweaty because it'd be irritating, it'd be uncomfortable. And also it's black as well so it's like hot out then I would struggle and sweat profusely. So I would, I would not wear this to the gym but I don't know it looks kind of nice for anything else. But it's also making my upper areas kind of like itch as well, so that can't be a good sign. It probably has like fleas or something like that, I don't know, maybe I'm going to come out with fleas now. So. Okay, so that's this video done over with, so what I've concluded is that there are some chair shop clothes which are quite good. Uh, I've actually worn some of these clothes and actually kind of like liked wearing them. I don't know, I feel like when I go to chair shops, like there are some like, really good clothes out there. I feel like chair shops like misrepresented for like clothes which are like rubbish or tatty, but I mean I even went to chair shops before and seen like Hugo Boss clothes uh, before that someone was supposed to dropped off. So there are some good clothing in chair shops, so not just all tatty clothing. Um, anyway, I'm gonna end this video here, so if you have liked this video, don't really like this video, scratch child, do all the things. I recommend everyone goes thrifting at some point and just kind of like gives it a go because thrifting is actually really good. Um, anyway, I'm gonna leave you guys be now and see you guys in another video. So, goodbye!